Hello everyone and welcome back to day 17 of our Vlogmas Christmas challenge. Mr. Pillager in the boat over there that we got last episode um, has not been tamed yet, but we will work on that. But I thought today we would just do a little bit of tidying up and a little bit more of exterior decorating. So let's see what we can do. So I have a bunch of dirt on me. We are just going to fill in all of this with dirt and eventually it'll turn to grass. Although if the snow keeps falling on it, then you'll never know, right? There we go. Now this is flat and so putting Christmas on presents under it will be much easier, of course. Uh, one thing with the Christmas presents, I'm unsure how to do it because, well, there's not that much space underneath of here. So at this moment, I just, I really don't know if I can put Christmas presents under there because I also really don't feel like using uh, my hard-earned shulker boxes to, and re them and putting them under here. So, so I did wanted to add a little bit of a lip to the Christmas tree just to give a little bit more definition. And by doing these half slabs, we'll also won't have the snow problem and you'll be able to really tell that this is a different area. So I think this, just adding that little bit in, just adds a little bit more definition and the fact that, you know, this is a separate location. So in some of these yards, as you can see, like there's a lot of snow and which means this is a cold biome, which means water would freeze. But I'm wondering if I can be strategic about where I place a light and actually be able to put in like maybe in this little area, a little bit of a wheat garden or something like that, just to add a little bit more life, a little bit more decoration to these areas. But I'm thinking if we just do a little bit of something like this, this could add so much more to the build to have a little bit of a crop garden out here. Now, do I actually have seeds? Oh, hello? Hi, pillagers. Well, that's interesting. I, I guess putting down boats work because I just got two more pillagers. Good to know. Okay, we'll ignore them for now. I guess we're breaking grass in the hopes that ooh, we got one seed. Can we get another one? I just for seeds, I don't want to go all the way back to my place. And four. Okay, we're going to try it with four seeds. And we'll just harvest. It'll be fine. There we go. So we'll just watch this and we'll replant it. But I think um, once level all of this actually grows up, I think this will look so nice. Found bone meal. Let's grow this weed up. There we go. And once this is all growing up. Ooh, I like that. Yes. So let's take a moment here and reposition where we're putting the front path here. Okay, so this is looking a lot better. I want to do something with this hillside. I want to make it a little bit more pretty. But on this hillside, I do believe that I would like flowers. And I'm thinking two tall high flowers like the red ones I think would look really well here. So I have some roses in my inventory and I have grabbed my shovel. So let's see what we can do about cutting back the side here as this guy decides he wants to hurt us some more. I think this could work. Let's see what we can do with the flower situation. Oh, that's looking pretty. I like it. I like it. Now, one thing I did want to try, and I don't know what this is going to look like, but what happens if we do like path blocks in between? It'll keep the snow down and it might look all right. Yes, yeah, so this is looking very nice. Added details. The one thing I kind of want to put in there is like a tree, but not that type of tree. Let's go see what we can do. I like that. That adds so much more to this area just to have that little tiny tree. I want to put another one. Okay, we got to go put another one, but I think up at the top would be good. But just having those 
added extra trees in there is so nice. So the other thing I wanted to try was just to put like a lantern inside of these trees. It will light things up, but I think it will also give a little bit of a glow, which could be really pretty. Yes, I like the little lights down from each of them. This is gorgeous. I really love how it came out and how it came together. This place is just filling out and looking so much more beautiful the more and more we go along. That adds just a little bit more that that place needed, just to kind of break it off from the rest of this area. I like it. I'm wondering if it's a little bit too much cobble. But I do wonder if instead of like texturing it with something else, if we simply just put like a couple of leaf blocks around here, if that would add a little bit of that added texturing that it needs. Honestly, I think that just adds enough to it that we can call this pretty good. I really like this. That looks so nice having this flower garden right here with a little bit of a wheat garden in front of that house and those two little trees adding so much more beauty to this area. So I really hope that you guys have enjoyed today's episode because I really enjoyed creating this and I look forward to doing more decorations throughout the rest of this area because this place is coming together so nicely. So if you like this content, don't forget to hit that like button. And if you're new, I would love if you would subscribe. And I will catch you in tomorrow's episode. Bye for now.